today, the way you played, you are more shot on target, you are more possession of the ball. How did you assess yeah, the game? It was a difficult game, of course. Uh, Arsenal had also their chances, we had also our chances. So yeah, maybe a 2-2, you always want more. Of course, you always want the three points, but now at the end, yeah, we have one point left to build on to Liverpool. To play like this, to come here and play the way you did, keeping the ball, creating those chances, and going behind twice and coming back into the game, that must be very, very positive for you going forward. Yeah, I think it's a good mentality for us. Uh, normally, when you come behind in this type of games, it's really difficult to come back. And I think we, we showed our mentality today to come back two times. And yeah, we have the point. Yeah, we want, of course, the three points, but we have the point. Yeah, how much did you enjoy this, the second half? Because obviously, you went back to 2 all, and, and it looked like you were kind of the favourites to win it. And you guys were winning the ball back high, playing it centrally. It looked like you were just embracing the situation and really enjoying it out there. Of course, when you have the ball, it's always better than you have to run the whole game when another team have the ball. So, of course, you have more. Yeah, you you enjoy it more when you have the ball, but you have to be ready because we know also that they are really difficult, uh, really dangerous in the counter attack. So, but yeah, what you say, it's always nice to have the ball in the game in the second half, of the, uh, the second half of the season, the second half of the, the game. Yeah, it was, it was a good game. And the development of the team, the relationships you're building around you. How is that going? Because it seems like it's been really really quick to be a cohesive unit and to play that well at a, a place like this from the team you mean yeah from like the, the, the players like around this, yeah. you yeah yeah, yeah. we of course we're building together to something we yeah together to something we we want to reach this season and i think it's going really well and we help each other and like we fight for each other so we have to keep that going and i think maybe it's going to be a yeah a nice year Mickey, it must take a lot of bravery to play the way you played against such a good team. You know, you're playing out from the back, yeah. they're pressing you. Can, can you just talk us through kind of the mentality you have to have to, to do that? Yeah, you have to do it. Uh, of course, you have some players who don't really like to play with the ball. Or, yeah, I don't know, they have a bit fear or something that they're going to lose the ball. But also what the trainer is telling us, uh, just keep playing. And uh, if you lose the ball, it can happen. Just try again. Like, keep trying, keep trying. And of course, you don't want us to, after three balls we lose, we ball to shoot the ball in the stands or something. So we have to just keep playing. And the trust also from the trainers, I think for me it's doing good as a centre back. Like for me it's okay to imagine I lose the ball one time and it's, I don't know, there's coming a big chance out of it. The trainers scream from the side, like oh, again, again, again. So it gives also, I don't know, some trust for you as a player to build up every time again and again. Is it, is it quite like exhilarating? Is it quite exciting? Because it is risky doing that. You know, sometimes you said yeah, someone's yeah, yeah. going to lose it. Yeah, yeah. How do you feel? When you're out there, kind of doing it time and again. Yeah, of course it's risky, but when you come out, like yeah. the nice situation, you always have like, oh yeah, this was it. <laughs> it's worth it. Nice. Yeah. What did the coach said after the game in the dressing room? Was he very happy? Was he a bit disappointed? But what what, what was the word that he chose? Well, it was uh, it was a good speech from the trainer after uh, yeah after the game. We had two two. We we showed our mentality to come back two times after a goal behind, and we have to keep pushing and uh, keep going like we're doing now. And then Liverpool is coming at home. And, uh, Hopefully the three points. Mickey, does best. this team not have any fear? I mean, you're smiling when you say Liverpool at home. We just come here to Arsenal and play well. There's no fear, right, in this team? No, I don't think we have a fear for a team. No. That's pretty positive, right? <laughs> yeah, 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 that's good. Yeah, it would be strange, I think, if you have fear for a team also. Yeah, I don't know. If you go into a tier and go a game and you're like, oh, yeah. what a team they have. I don't know. I don't think it's positive. So, what was the feeling when the ten minutes? went off at the end. Uh, I think in previous seasons, Spurs might have thought, oh, here we go. But there was just, it just felt, it just felt extremely calm and assured that you weren't going to concede and maybe you might even win. It's quite, I have to say, it's quite, I know you've only just got here, but yeah, it, it feels like quite a moment. Yeah, I don't know how it was before, of course, but to be honest, when I saw the 10 minutes extra time, I was also like, oh, 10 minutes is long, to be honest. But, <laughs> Yeah. Uh, yeah, we don't have the fear like, oh, they're pushing, they're pushing. We're like, okay, we keep doing what we have to do, 10 more minutes, and maybe we can win the game. So we keep pushing to, to get yeah. the three points. We still play the high line, too. Sorry, I don't know if you're asking, we still play the high line even until the end. Yeah, exactly. It's, that's that's, our, that's yeah. the spirit, right? That's, that's yeah, how that's we want to play. So yeah. We have to do it even if it's extra time. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. And for even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock. And be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you there.